And I'm back with more Final Fantasy IX. Last time, we defeated a giant snake dude known as Giza Maluk, and now we're in control of Garnet. I think I'm good. May I see your gate pass? Yep, there you go. Alright, please step inside. <laughs> Let us sit here. Please wait while we wait for departure. made it. Thank you for your kind words. No, I thank you. Oh. Now departing. <sighs> I feel more relaxed now. That's understandable. Our journey from Lindblom was very tough, but... It was your white magic that helped us through those battles against the monsters. And your fortitude that got us past the obnoxious Moogles and the two... But obnoxious Moogles? Boo. And finally, your idea to use Gisaw pickles at the gate. I'm thoroughly impressed by your intelligence and courage, Princess. Steiner, you can't call me that. Uh, my apologies, I'm just not used to. It's okay. I made a lot of mistakes when Zidane made... Uh, taught me how to talk like this. That peasant had no manners whatsoever. Although, he did have some wit for a bumpkin, but the way he spoke to you was simply unacceptable. I say good riddance. And back to here. Can you stand up? Don't worry about me. Please put Damn it! I will protect Bermisha. You have my word. Alright, so... I'm going to avoid fighting for a little while. And you'll see why in a minute. Save travel, save travel, yay. But we are now in Burmesian territory. We'll see a south gate. The smell of fire. And blood? Ah, there must have been a huge battle on the other side of this gate. Something smell bad! I get bad feeling! Huh? <laughs> Smells not good. You smell flower? <laughs> Queena does whatever they feel like doing. I must learn their ways. I don't think it's intentional. No. If I'd done as I pleased, I would have been... Flower tastes good! See what I mean? But still. Let's go. Bermisia is just ahead. So I've heard it said that Queena is one that just does whatever they feel like and doesn't let the little things bother them. That being said, despite being able to learn a thing from Queena, it's just... She's the worst character. Between that and Amaranth, it's like, they don't do anything plot-wise, they're just there. So again, it's not like this game is perfect. It's just the top four characters in the game are really fucking good, and Freya as a fifth character is pretty good, too. I ain't going there yet. But the reason why I'm avoiding fa fighting right now, you'll see in a minute, 
See you in a minute. Hmm. Aha! Go ahead! There's a ukulele. Wow. <laughs> All right. And this strange smoke. These are the things you want to get. Those who seek companions and a home. Choco, you seek a quiet life with other chocobos. Am I right? Come here! Wanderer, we await your return. Choco, you now have the ability to cross rivers. You can only get to the lagoon through a beach. The road is long, but you have taken the first step. Yay! So not a lot you could do right now on this side of the of the continent, but at least I'm pretty sure. But once you get to once you get back to the Lindblom side, you'll be able to do things. But looky! Yeah. So you can get to the lighter areas. And there might be... Hmm. It's possible that one of these are here, but I don't think so. But now this opens up a little bit more. I can't get that one. Okay, that one's probably... Hmm. I think both of those are, are down towards Lindblom, if I remember. Obviously, I'll look them up later, but I'll worry about that next time. Because we'll be back to Lindblom in no time flat. But now I can cross rivers! Ah! So let's go to a place that rains a lot. Because, because it's important. Because we're at the end of disc one. It seems strange, though, because I think the ends of disc one in eight and nine are way shorter than it looks. Probably because the disc one in Final Fantasy seven was just so long and full of stuff. So this is Freya's home. What are you doing? Get over here! It's been five years. I've been away for so long. Not a night went by that I didn't dream about home. I can't believe I'm here. I'm no longer the selfish child I was five years ago. The time has come to serve my kingdom as a dragon knight once again. I'll do what I can to help. Me too! I have to! Let's go. The realm of eternal rain. What can I do for my kingdom? This is not the time. Huh? Oh. Cancer. Cancer headed to the cape where Virgo waited. The sun was setting into the ocean. Would he finally see her?
So another Stelazio coin. Nah! It is them again! Most persistent they are! Black mages! Kill! Right. May we stab you and stab you and stab you so that you don't hit us with fire. Bonk. Oh man. Well, thunder, but that still can hurt. Actually, no, it doesn't hurt her, which is good. Stab. There's fire. Ah! Ow! But yes, if I level up off screen, I don't have to worry about fighting in in the. Because again, on a stream, doesn't matter because it's a stream. It's just long form content. In a YouTube video, I'm trying to be as snappy as I can be. For the sake of the viewer! The general will punish you for this! Yes! Very scary it is when general gets mad. Yes! Yes! General Beatrix is one of the best characters in the game! And we have to fight her! Drag. So I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure, yeah, that box is a mimic, so I don't want to hit it. There are two mimic boxes in here, which suck, but what can you do? So you gotta go up here, go around, and you gotta go back around, and you gotta do that, and it's dumb. There are enemies in here that cause petrification. I think that's the mimic box. No, no, I think... I think both sides. So you need a bell over there. And no, you cannot grab that... I don't believe you can grab that um, treasure, so... It's a false flag. But again, I ran into this with Legend of Mana. If I can avoid random encounters, like, Yakuza is one thing, because they're random encounters out on the street, but you can't, like, not avoid them. You can just go down a side street. In the old school games, barring, say, the Chrono stuff or Xenosaga, it was random encounters. I I just want the choice to fight if I, if I can be bothered. And I said this in Final Fantasy VI, I, fa I said this in Final Fantasy X, and 10-2, you save a lot of time not having to bother. Is it that I can't handle the fights here? No. Get the bell by the bed. It's more that it's a hassle to try and get through a room or, say, an area like this where you're trying to backtrack, you know, because you're trying to backtrack around this area. And it's not the longest area, but it can be. But I'm saving so much time. This is what I what I dealt with with Tower of Layers. Where a annoying climb up a tower that could have taken potentially an hour took 20 minutes. And we're able to get a lot more story. Because again, I'm not... I'm not bothered by the story, or I mean, I'm not bothered by the gameplay, I'm bothered by the story not being fleshed out because I'm stuck having to deal with the battle system, which, as I've said, is on the slow side. You could do a lot more if, say, I just do all my grinding off screen if I can help it. Zidane, Remesia's royal palace is beyond these steps. It must be in ruins, just like everything else. I can't bear to see it like that. I understand, but we can't go back now. We've got to find out who's behind this. I, I want to find those guys were, and why I look like them. Look, Vivi's scared too, but we have to face reality. Come on, Freya, it'll be okay. Vivi? 
Do you really know what you're doing? The answer you seek may forever change you for your Ow! She is a... I mean, she's a realist, but that is a pessimistic way of looking at things. Um... Yeah, but... I have to. I have to find out who I really am. I, I'm scared, but what if I'm not even human? Vivi. What are you talking about? I am definitely human. Someone's coming. Who are you? Are you in league with the Black Mages? No. You're lying. There's a Black Mage right behind you. I didn't do anything. I wouldn't hurt anyone. Liar. He's telling the truth. Freya? It's good to see you, Dan. Damn, I haven't seen you in years. Where have you been? Uh, actually, this is probably not the best place to talk. We gotta get out of here fast. There are Black Mages swarming all over the place. Mm yeah. What are you waiting for? Where's the king? I don't know. I didn't see him at the palace. Well, I'm going. I have my own family to worry about. Forget about the king and get out of here. We're no match for those black mages. Hmm. I will protect my home and my king at any cost. Let's go to the palace. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> Queen Edge just bobbing her, bobbing her head. Ah. Now, this is a scene you can do, you don't have to do, but it's nice. Come on, dear, we have to go now. I can't move anymore. Go on without me. I can't do that. Remember that promise we made? How could I forget? But my only wish is for you and the child to survive. Please bear a healthy child. Cow. It's too dangerous to stay here. You've got to escape. I'm sure Regent Sid will help. But my husband, he was hurt by those black mages. He can't move. How can we possibly escape? Uh, oh, whoa! Uh, that was close. Gee, thank you. Thanks. Hey, are you okay? We survived somehow. Can you give me a hand? Sure. Thanks again, pal. We'll see you again in Lindblom. By then, my kids will be born. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Take care. Whoops, wrong way. Is there anything in here? See, this is one of those things you could do, is check around for treasure. And you not have to fight anything. Just so many reasons not to fight a damn thing. So there's another door. But yeah, I think that's another mimic chest. He's just gonna try and chomp me, not look forward to it. Um, yeah, these two chests I think are normal. Oh, gee, I wonder what we're going to grab. I think it's staring me right in the face. Is there anything here we can use? Hmm. The sphere. Wah! Wah! It's pretty light and easy to use. All right, let's go beat up some black mages. Come on, you know I didn't mean you. I know. Blech. Never mind. Huh? BB. Oh man, I'm gonna want that. I'm gonna want that. 
Next time I get to fight, or grind, I will. Hey, yeah. Mog shop. Okay. Well, good. Here's what I need my money for. Dang it! Thanks for delivering a letter! I heard Stiltskin's heading in your direction. I never met him, so tell me what it's like if you meet him. Check and see if he travels with a map of the entire world like the rumor says. I never met Stiltskin either. I'll give you this in exchange for the delivery. I have a favor to ask, Koopo. Thanks, Koopo! Let's save it. Not quite done here. It's probably going to be a bit of a longer episode. Yoink. Lightning staff. Well, look who we have here. Hey, buddy. Did you want to buy something? Well, there he is. I'll say a soft... High potion and an ether for money. Thanks. Let's hope we keep going for another week or so. That guy is awesome. He'll just give you stuff. Anyway. Lightning staff. Yeah. I'm sorry, but from the looks of this, nothing made it. I don't know what to tell you. We can only hope that the king and the others escaped. Let's go see what's going on over there. Huh? Ah! There's someone inside the palace. What are you waiting for? Get up here! You make it sound so easy. I guess we start here. Come on! Um. Ugh. Oh, man. I'm gonna go on ahead. Uh, try to find another way up top. I need you at the eat food head palace. Whatever works. Poor Vivi. And I don't expect Quina to jump. Ever. Uh oh. Who's that? Oh, this is bad news. I knew she was behind all this. What do you mean you knew? I decided to re return to Burmishi when I heard rumors that Bronn had set her sights in the kingdom. Then that girl standing next to her must be Beatrix. That's Beatrix? The cold-blooded knight who knows no mercy. Beatrix. Yes. I hear there are many fierce warriors out in the world. Some even more powerful than I. Beatrix of Alexandria, in particular. They say her swordsmanship is best in- Yeah. Still, do you insist on going on your journey? Yes. Please understand. Right now, Burmesia is at peace, while other nations slowly but surely gain power. I don't know if my spear alone is enough to protect Burmesia, which is precisely why I must go out into the world. So, Fratley... Oh, you're going to be fine. Trust in your strength, and face your destiny. Once I complete my journey, I will return to Burmesia. Then promise me one more time you'll return. I promise. Fratley. You never did come back. You left me nothing but rumors of your death. I couldn't believe it. I still won't believe it. 
Not unless I see proof with your own eyes. And I will travel across the entire world if I must. You okay? Yes. I was just thinking about the past. Still can't get over him, huh? But who's that? Oh, this'll be fun. I find this rain quite pleasant. It feels as though raindrops are blessing our victory. This is a great victory for us, Gucha. Your black mages made this conquest so simple. My only concern now is finding the king of Bermisia. We must take care of him once and for all, and prevent those rats from rising up again. Beatrix, what's taking so long? I don't know, Your Majesty. I've ordered Zorn and Thorn to search the perimeter, but there have been no words so far. I will join them and lead the search right away. You're wasting your time. What? Rats often look for new homes when they sense an earthquake. They've probably moved to the sandy treehouse by now. So you see, it's too late. The king has already turned tail and fled. Sandy Treehouse. Surely you don't mean Clara. It'll be quite different if it's difficult if they escaped to there. Clara. Unless we can get through the sandstorm, it'll be impossible to attack them. Sneaky little rats. Kuja. What do you think? Surely, with your powers, there must be something you can do. Of course, Your Majesty. I will present you a marvelous display of my power. I am certain you will be most pleased. I was wondering if you could gather troops near Clara. I'm certain those filthy rats will retaliate in full force, and my black mages may not be enough. Sounds like we've got trouble. That sinister man, who is he? It's me. I've never seen him before. I'd have never mistaken a girl for that hotness. Because yes, that guy wears a cod piece. They made him so impossibly beautiful, it's impossible. Sounds like they're going to Clara. I've always wondered why they called it City of Illusion. Clara has remained in isolation for a hundred years. If my people escape there, they'll be safe for at least a little while. What's that place like? The people of Clara were originally from Bermisia. Long ago, they severed ties over trivial conflicts. But now the kingdom's in peace, shielded by a large sandstorm. Looks like someone's coming. What's he thinking? Oh, this is a bad idea. Bermisio will never fall. Prepare to die. You want to fight me? Beatrix of Alexandria? I commend your courage, but I will show you no mercy. The, the, hold it! You have to deal with us first. Go on, get out of here. Protect it with your life. <laughs> I've never been so humiliated in my life. I once killed a hundred knights single-handedly. To me, you two are nothing more than insects. So, you could steal from her. I'd highly, I'd highly avoid that because she has a couple of insta-death moves. So, if she does it, you're gonna have a hard time trying to heal. So yeah, just beat the shit out of her. Ow. I'm gonna want this for at least a little while.
The only reason I survived that was Mighty Guard. And you see how barely I survived that. And she'll use that every few turns or so. Everything else is relatively minor, but still painful. So yeah. Just don't. Good thing I'm doing damage, though. Ow! Just pick the highest... Pick the highest damage move and go. Yink! That's pretty damn nice. Oh. Oh great, he just decided, yep, you're done. It's supposed to lose fight, so uh you do want to damage her, though. So it's like half is supposed to lose fight and then not. <laughs> Ridiculously weak. Is there anyone worthy of facing me? Come, Beatrix. We must prepare the attack on Clayro. Your Majesty! Now, what do we have here? Another filthy rat and... This boy could be a problem. I'm so beautiful. Oh, so ever beautiful. Check out my cod piece and butt pants. Or lack of butt pants. I am so good and you are so... Waste. Do you have a dragon? I have a dragon. That means I'm better than you. <laughs> Come on, you didn't think I wouldn't do a villain speech, would you? Of course I'm gonna do a villain speech. And we go right into disc two. No, no transitions, that's pretty neat. There's been a lot of trouble lately. Oh, you mean Burmacia? I heard they were attacked by an army of soldiers wearing pointy hats. I want to go fight in the front line and get some rotten away on some stinking gate. Really? I don't like wars. A guy who passed through here with that huge bag, does he look suspicious to you? Nah, I don't think so. But weren't you the one who thought he was suspicious? You know me, I'm always like that. I'm telling you, people who eat pickles are nice people. I envy him. These all pickles are the only pickles I can't eat. You're really confusing, you know that? I know. Why do you think I ended up here? Pfft. He's got a point. But yes, we are now in disc two, and we're focusing on Garnet and Steiner. The conductor said we'll be arriving at Summit Station soon. Brit. Uh, Miss Dagger. Oh, she's sleeping. Yeah, let's turn that off. 
The princess believes what she heard about Queen Braun. She would never start a war. It's all a misunderstanding. She'll see that when she talks to the queen. I need not concern myself with such matters. My only mission is to protect the princess. Summit Station! Summit Station! Thank you very much. Take care. It'll be a while until the car to Alexandria arrives. How long? About the same. Why don't you just go and rest in the arrest area? Okay. What's wrong, Steiner? Princess! What did I say about... We're finally home! Really? We're home. But I still can't see the castle. Princess, Alexandria may only mean the castle to you, but... Hey, are you making fun of me? N no, I'm not. Yeah, it's okay. Let's go. Need to find a save point. Must be the rest area. Let us gather information while we wait for the car. Ah, you have to try our famous bunt kick. Perfect gift for family. Did I say get? Gift. Take one home today for your loved ones. It's the world famous Southgate bunt kick. So, can I buy it? Get your supplies! Hooray! Good thing I have the money. Ah, damn. Yeah, good thing I have the money for this stuff. More importantly, I have a save point. Grimo? I feel so sad when I see Mary, the part-time worker. Have you ever fallen in love? I've never fallen in love, Koopo. F watching someone fall in love is difficult. I wonder how difficult it is to actually fall in love myself. Well, I've never fallen in love. It's just not worth it. I have a favor to ask, Koopo. I want you to deliver a letter to Mochas. Thank you, Koopo. And save. And we've completed another episode. We are technically within disc two, but you didn't see a transition. So we... This game's great. <laughs> the time of switching discs is long gone now. I love, I love it. Anyway. Time to see what Garnet and Steiner get up to. Next time.